happens here, Whitman. Once known as Little Comfort, probably because they made a lot of shoes. There were more than 20 shoe factories in Whitman that are now, you guessed it, condos. Whitman's town motto is the birthplace of the chocolate chip cookie, and that makes sense because Whitman is the birthplace of the chocolate chip cookie. Legend has it there was a restaurant in an old toll house. The cook accidentally spilled a jar of chocolate pieces into the cookie dough, and they served the cookies anyway, and the rest is history. Except it's not. So what's the real story? It's a little unclear, but here's what we do know. This is Ruth Graves Wakefield, the inventor of the chocolate chip cookie. If she were alive today, the one thing she'd want to tell you is that it was no accident. In 1930, she and her husband bought a tourist lodge and rebranded it. They claimed it was an old toll house. Not true. Built in 1709. Also not true. Ruth wanted to create the restaurant of her dreams and traveled the world looking for recipes. It turned out she was a culinary prodigy with the ability to recreate any dish she tasted. The Toll House Inn was a huge hit, even among the celebs of the time, including the Kennedys. Ruth was secretive about the cookie's origins, but in her later years, she claimed she worked out the recipe on a trip back from Egypt. The world's first Toll House cookie dropped in 1938, and it was instantly insanely popular. Soon, the Toll House Inn drew the attention of Andrew Nestle himself. He personally struck a deal with Ruth, who handed over the rights to the cookie in exchange for all the chocolate she wanted for the rest of her life. Hold on, really? Who knows? But that was her story. So if you're in Whitman and you want to taste the original, head to the corner of Route 18 and oops. The Toll House Inn burned down in 1984, but at least you can still see the sign. But is that the actual sign? Or, you know what? Never mind. <laughs>